so that's the water cube at night. And uh, this whole hall is uh, no sitting or stamping. Yes, we don't like stamping. We don't want to post anything, do we? God forbid we post something. Now we're entering the bird's nest. And wow, this stadium is huge. Wow. Oh, wow. Set up for a soccer game at the moment, I guess. How many people? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> uh, 15,000? <laughs> More than that. <laughs> Uncountable. We've got upper levels. There's three levels of seating. Can't imagine. Well, we saw the water cube and the bird's nest today, and I've got a splitting headache. It's starting to get better now that I've got some paracetamol drugs in me. But I blame the air. Um, let me swing the camera around. You can see the pollution level. <sighs> yeah, a lot of pollution. The air is very thick with smog here in Beijing. Um, anyway, here's a little something that they sell in Beijing. Um, it's Beijing yogurt drink, essentially. Um, you see this for sale um, by street vendors and your hotel might have it and a few other places. Um, that's what it looks like unopened and you just stick a straw through that paper lid and uh, here's what it looks like when you've finished one and uh, <laughs> there's actually not much in there um, it's because it's like a heavy thick kind of um, ceramic bowl it's it's not like a milk bottle it's, it's, it's bigger and it's thicker and heavier than a milk bottle it's very very heavy um, so if you buy one from a street vendor, you can't just run off and take away <laughs> because they want the bulk. Um, but yeah, it's, it's basically yogurt that you drink through a straw. Um, pretty tasty. A little bit sour though. And, well, you pay 5 yuan for them. Oh yeah, one other thing too. Got this at the, uh, at the bird's nest. I'm a gold medalist now. That's my gold medal. That was 15 yuan. I overpaid for it. I probably should have only paid 5 to 10. I'm now a gold medalist. <laughs>